Hi, my name is Damien Wills, Chief Pilot and Owner of GoFly Aviation, and welcome to this week's GoFly Tips. This week we're going to be looking at the most common problem with would-be students wanting to land a plane and also experienced pilots on why they're not landing straight in nil wind or when there's no crosswind. And the reason is usually pretty simple and we're going to be looking at that with Stephen today. What is often missed uh, with, uh, with instruction is that the student's eyes aren't looking straight ahead, they're actually looking to the end of the runway but through the spinner and prop. That's right, and that's what I was doing. Yep, Yeah. exactly. So with two tandem, uh, with, with the side-by-side -side seating, the fact is that you're not sitting in the middle of the aircraft. Yeah. So if you look through that spinner to your left, you're going to have some parallax error there. Yeah, that's right. You're going to think you're straight, yeah. but you're not straight. Yeah. So the best way I've found with students is to imagine that you're flying in a magic seat. Yep. To get the props there and you look straight ahead. Yeah. So you're looking straight ahead here and at the windscreen and to the end of the runway. Yeah. But getting the prop and spinner are there. Yeah. What we're going to do is set ourselves up for a long final approach. And I'm going to just practice this alignment. Flight traffic sling 8068 is turning base runway 05, full stop Calandra. Commander traffic check 7520 turn final runway 05, touch and go Commander. This is a really good technique to help students one, learn rudder control, um, keeping aligned with the center line, yep. and learning to what straight looks like. Okay, I'm going to control the power and I'm going to do the ailerons and elevator. I want you to do nothing else but the rudder. Okay. And that includes when we land. Okay, we're on a very long final now for 05 at Calandra. I want you to keep, imagine that center line, Stephen, coming up through the air. Yep. And I want you to keep that center line coming up through your legs. And I'm going to tell you when I think you're aligned with the runway, and I do not want you looking through the prop. I want you looking straight ahead. Yeah. Okay. So at the moment you're aligned nicely. You're off to the left a bit, but that's okay where you're trying to line up with the center line. But I'm just letting yeah. you know when your nose, when the aircraft is not aligned straight yep. with that runway. Keep on that radar. Plane traffic sling AD68 is mid final, 05, full stop Calandra. This is a really interesting experience for me, mate. Yeah, it really enhances those rudder skills. Yeah, and keeps you really focused on that center line as yep, well. Yep, absolutely. But remember, we want to be keeping the wings level at this height using rudder for our center line yeah. alignment. So now you're going off to the left a bit. Yep, um, that's the way. The more you work that rudder, the less corrections you have to make closer to the ground. Yeah. Um, and we're climbing to um, 3,500 metres, uh, tracking to Hazleton, Kalandra. Okay, we have 30 feet, we have 20 feet, 10 feet, we start to flare a little to the end, so you're off to the left a little bit now, so a bit of right, right, straight, that's not straight. That's not straight, quite straight, that's about a bit more, that's about straight there. Good, that's straight. Yep, stay on the center line. Now, good training as well is when we're taxiing, we're actually stopping now, so don't want you to get that center line between your legs. Yeah. And while you're taxiing, practice what straight is. So look straight ahead, don't look through the spinner. Yep. And we're just teaching our brain what straight is yeah. with the aircraft. As soon as you look through the spinner, you, doesn't, you have a natural tendency to want to go left a little bit. Yeah. Look right ahead, that's the way. Good. Well, thanks for joining me in today's Go Fly Tips. As you can see, when you're not landing straight, usually the reason is your eyes aren't in the right spot. Don't look through the propeller, don't look through the spinner, look straight ahead and imagine you're on a magic seat looking straight ahead on that bitumen or grass runway. Thanks again, happy and safe flying and see you next time.